Well, I'm going to start packing. Before I do that, I'm going to make the bed. I got everything clean. Well, I washed the floor in here in the pantry and I'm, I'm just doing up all my laundry and ironing. Okay, I'm going to go clean the bathroom now. Good day, everybody. I'm going to do a little bit of meal prep. I have a few more nights left here. Clean the house today. So I'm boiling four eggs and I got five pieces of bacon and a few chicken breasts. I'm going to make a peanut chicken uh, salad with feta cheese and all that. I'll show you everything as I go. Okay, I cooked my bacon and I boiled my eggs. I just washed my chicken. I think I'm going to do two as peanut chicken and one is maybe a Greek style or something, something different because this will last me three days. And all, everybody always comments because I wash my meat. I wash all my meat, all of it. You don't know who's touched it, right? I just wash it in lemon or vinegar, whatever. Yeah, I decided to do all three chicken breasts in the peanut sauce. Um, and I'm using the baking grease as the, for the flavor underneath it. So I buy my peanut sauce, this one here from President's Choice. I just poured a little bit over it. And I will probably add about a quarter cup of water once it starts cooking and then put a lid on it. And then I'll caramelize it all. It turns out beautiful. Okay, my chicken's at the point where I have to really watch it now because it's gonna caramelize with the peanut sauce. I have my salad prepped. I'm just gonna add some feta cheese. I have egg, bacon, mushrooms, arugula, spinach, onion, and I usually add cucumber, but I don't have any, but it's still gonna be wonderful. Okay, I added feta, and now I'm just gonna let the chicken cool down a little bit, and then I'll add the chicken on top. And this is a whole meal, and this is gonna make me three dinners. Chicken's down, it's all caramelized, and it looks really yummy. And I'm gonna use a ranch dressing. Okay, I put the chicken on and I drizzled a little bit of ranch over top and I'm gonna go eat dinner. It looks amazing. It's just a big pile of arugula and spinach underneath. So it looks bigger than it is. It's not even one whole chicken breast in there. As you see, my pan's still full. Um, and I'm gonna go eat this. Tomorrow, I'm gonna clean the whole house, change the linens, put out all fresh towels and sheets and pack. I'll see you in the morning. Good morning, all my beautiful people. I'm just doing up all my laundry and ironing because I'm going to get ready and pack and clean the house today. It's really gray out, but I thought we'd get busy. Uh, I want to leave the bed fresh, the towels, all that kind of stuff, like, you know, the bathroom cleaned. And so when I walk in, it's all I have to do is maybe dust and that. I was possibly, was supposed to be going for a month, but I might be going for a little less because now my daughter's not going away. So I might just go for a few weeks and come back a little bit early. We'll see what, what happens. I'm going to go with the flow. Oh, well, I'm going to start packing. Before I do that, I'm going to make the bed. I got everything clean. I'll get all that done and then we'll get busy and start picking out some clothes. The weather there is probably about highs, maybe 21, 22. Lows about 12, 14. So we'll see. That's Celsius. I talk Celsius. And, uh... So I'm going to get busy and clean the bedroom first, vacuum everything, dust, make the bed, put all the fresh linens on, put some clothes away, sweater stuff away. I won't be needing that. And hopefully can make some cute outfits. I'm just doing a carry on. Okay, my worst chore is done. I just got my bed done. It's just putting those duvets on and all that is so much work. And I have four pillows and it's Anyways, it is what it is. I'm done. And now I'm going to start pulling some clothes. I started pulling some, throwing them in the suitcase. But I'm going to bring it into the living room and see which ones I want to um, take with me. But everything in here is clean. All I have to do is uh, go with some jewelry in here. And then I'm going to go take care of the rest. Clean the bathroom now. I just did my bed. That is my absolute worst chore. Uh, I'm going to take everything out and scrub it down in the bathroom and then I'll put out all fresh stuff. Well, I pretty much have the bathroom all done. I'm just finishing the mirror here. Do you guys use Bon Ami or Windex? I like the Bon Ami in the spray. That's my favorite. I really like that. It's always it's like no streaks or something. I don't know. I'm a big fan of the, the product anyways. Anyways, this is all nice and clean. I got the tub done too. And hi everybody, I look beautiful, right? 
not. Anyways, I have so much little trinkets everywhere. I don't have much in the bathroom though. That's for my cream, my face cream, my Q-tips. Oh, I usually do this this way. And then my scrubber for washing my face. And then on this side, this is my daily cream. I usually just leave it there. Oh, I usually don't leave it there, I'm wrong. I leave it on this side. I need to refill my soap. No, not really, it's not too bad. Anyways, that's all done. This is my little jewelry box in the bathroom. I keep it on the windowsill. And I just need to put a fresh hand towel out, which I've got one out. I don't have a hook for a hand towel here. I would like one, but I would like it to be really, really fancy and vintage. So until I find that, I would like to put it around here. Until I find that, I am not drilling into the subway tile. Bath's all nice and clean. I need to fill up the conditioner. I use that more than I use anything. I use double conditioner, like one bottle of shampoo to four bottles of conditioner. This is all done, all nice and clean. My bath, I have a little bath mat here by the sink. Just a small one. I think I got it in the thrift store for a dollar. It's an Ikea one. And then I got a fresh towel here. I'll hang up and I keep that behind the door. It's my pajamas, my pajama bottoms, the top uh, in the dryer. And I think I'm done in here. Oh, I'll do a bath mat here too for when I get out of the shower. So that's all nice and clean. Everything's done. Everything looks good. Need to bring the Bon Ami with me. Um, I, I, I already did this down this morning, or I already did, I already did this cupboard down. This one gets really dusty for some reason. This is a great medicine cabinet and it fits perfect in here. Anyways, that's it for the bathroom. Pretty much done here in the living room. I'm just giving Hunter a little wipe down. He gets really dusty for some reason. Don't you love his little fur collar? This is all done too. I, just going to finish up vacuuming, and I think I'm good here. I already wiped all that down. I have to take this leaf out. I'm, I'm going to do that with a knife. Oh, maybe just break it off. There's a new one coming. I'm going to pull it back a bit. I have to water everything really, really, really good. Um, these are all growing really well, and everything's all dusted. I do a little trim in there too, I guess. That's not a big deal. And then I'm going to corral all my little plants so my girlfriend doesn't have to walk all over the house and find them. I'll make it easy for her and I'll corral them on the kitchen table. But, yeah. I think I need to pull that out a bit. I didn't have the light on. I'm sorry. I think I'm good. I'm not gonna bother crawling this one. I'm gonna leave it, it's a very sensitive plant. And I'm just gonna leave it where it is. I'll turn it so the sun gets it differently. And I cut off about six leaves off my big elephant leaf. It was just too big for the living room. So I had to cut that back. But I'm good here, I'm just gonna finish up vacuuming. And then I'm gonna give the floor a quick wipe down. And I think I'm good for that. Probably, uh, head into the pantry and then the kitchen. Everything will be nice and clean when I get home. I need to do the chandelier, but that's gonna come in another time and I got two burnt out light bulbs for like a month, maybe two months now. Well, I washed the floor in here in the pantry and I wiped everything down. Everything's good. My new little jar, I haven't put anything in it yet, but I will. And I think I'm done in here. I just have the mop out to do the kitchen floor and wipe the counters down and the cupboards down and I think I'm good. But this one's all nice and shiny and clean. I love my pantry. Isn't it cute? Okay, kitchen's all done. I just was sitting there waiting for the floor to dry. Made myself a coffee. Uh, I'm good. My dinner's made for tonight. I'm just having leftover chicken, salad, 
And I think everything's good. While I'm in LA, I'm gonna to try to find a little picture for there. I'm just looking for something special. I know I can buy it offline. I know a lot of things, but I just, I just want to find a little cute little thing. When I see it, I'll know, right? I'm going to have a coffee now, and then I'm going to start packing. But I'm glad that everything's done, so when I come home, it's just easy peasy, right? Gather all my little plants, and I put them on here, and I leave a pitcher out so it's easier for her to uh, water my plants rather than leaving them like I have little ones all over the place. You know, like small ones. So I leave the big ones. But the ones up here, I have a couple in the bedroom. Things like that. It just makes it easier on her. So that's how I do that. Okay, let's get packing. For now, I picked up these cream kind of jean pants and a pair of orange ones, but I haven't got to that yet. For the white, I can wear just all white. Uh, or I can wear the polka dot in white or the stripe in white. For these ones, they're kind of a caramel color. I can wear more dressy, the uh, tiger one, or just cream. And I also have this sweater if it gets cold. Then I have these are like a track pant, which I can wear that with. And I can also take that out and... I don't know what's on there, but I'll have to check that out. I can wear that with. Uh, so I can mix and match these three pair of pants. So I think I'm going to add a color in. So I might add an orange in, an orange pair of pants. And then I can do a stripe top with them, the blouse. Or I can do this one, which is a little warmer. So that's kind of where I'm leaning. And let's see what else I can come up with. But that mixes and matches, so that gives me a lot of different looks, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Gives me 10 or 12 looks. And then I can rotate. So that's where I am so far. I have this ribbed uh, long dress. I can dress up with the cream and black sweater, or I could wear a white tee underneath it. Um, maybe I'll find a white blouse too, so I can dress this up a bit. I have to get this vase into there, and I'm carrying another bag in case I buy stuff, which is in the other side. For shoes, I'm taking a pair of cognac shoes. I'm gonna wear sneakers. And I'm going to take maybe my um, leopard print shoes, something like that, and a pair of flip-flops or something for around the yard. I got some of the plants here. I just got a few more to collect. And I'm almost packed. I got everything into there. Um, the only thing I added after was a nightgown a house dress and a cognac pair of shoes, a coupe pair of shoes, and a pair of flip-flops. Here I have my iPad, my headset, very minimal makeup, and a little bit of perfume and creams and things like that. I don't need a blow dryer or anything because I have one there. And all I got left to do is press the clothes that I'm gonna wear on the plane. I'm wearing pink shoes with this. I know it's not fancy, but that's okay. Um, and that's it. Now, Hunter, you take care of the house for Mama. Be nice to Leah when she comes to water the plants. And I'll talk to you later. Say bye to everybody. We'll, we'll see you in Los Angeles. Loves. To answer your messages is because I'm on the plane flying, but I'll get to them probably Wednesday night or Thursday morning, whatever one I have time. But I'm thinking of you, but please leave a message and I will get back to you when I can. Say bye, Hunter. <laughs> Loves everybody. Merry ho ho.